Hey guys, what's going on? It's Kevin, East Cape Skiffs. Behind me, another 2015 Vantage. This one is going to the Carolinas. This is another example of what we do here. We're gonna start at the bow and work our way back. First thing you're gonna notice is we actually have the 24 volt iPilot system. Offset cleat, we put it right here so that way when you have the trolling motor you still get more scope instead of putting it right in the middle. But we have the offset cleat. Then we also have the East Cape stakeout system. So you can do a manual stakeout off the bow to get different positions if that's what he likes. The other thing is, is uh, looking at the trailer, the standard Ramlin trailer, oversized jack stand and winch. He has the nice contrasting two-tone. This looks beautiful on this boat, the black rub rail. Going further back, we obviously have the V-Marine push pull holders, but if you look here, you'll see the hatch and a hatch. So you see all that storage is finished out. And you see the nice liner that's inside the hatches on the Vantage. All the hatches are lined and they're off the floor and proper drainage. We wanted today to open this boat up to show you guys so many manufacturers show a boat 100 feet away and they all look good guys. But that old saying, you know, good from far, but far from good. Well, at East Cape, they're good far and they're good up close. So we're showing you everything, not just telling you. Moving further back, we have the nice jump seat cut down for what the customer wanted. He chose the flush mount version for his electronics. Here's the Garmin. He's got his uh, wet storage, dry storage, cooler right there. He has the two cup holders there. He does have his jack plate switch. You'll also notice he has a tilt helm. This is what Robert wanted. And what you want is what you get. Notice all his controls and switches are inside. It's a nice little area. We just got the boat washed and uh, detailed up. But uh, nice dry compartment for all your switches. And it just gives it a clean look, guys, when you have all your switches right there. And it just cleans up the, uh, the console top. But anyways, then walk, going further back, we obviously have the electronic area. You'll also notice that we got the plugs in the drains. He has access to his live well, his battery switch. He is a tournament and bait guy. Notice we have the live well with the divider in it. It is removable. And he also has a little clip in there for his uh, bait well. Then on the other side, we have the wet storage or dry storage because it's a line compartment again with the drain. Then if we go further back, he wanted the standard pulling platform we offer, just a little taller to accommodate the jack plate. He's powering it with the new 115 Yamaha. He has the clamp on rod holders because you can change the way you fish. You're not committed to something that's welded. He wanted the flat steps with a little skid tape. It's not a problem. This is what we do because we have our in-house welding. We have a directional light underneath. This is typically what you see on uh, T-tops, but allows you to spin it around and get that direction that you want for if you're fishing at night or coming in at night. Lean bar tubes going on in the front and back. He has a standard prop. But guys, this is just an awesome boat. The Vantage, 19-2, 79 inch beam. It's the biggest boat in its class and still on performance reports next to all the other brands, it's on par or better shallower draft because of the volume its displacement has to do with physics and it's a very dry ride you can fish from bonefish to this thing redfish run the blue water run the beach if you want to and you could do everything you want from cobia you know tarpon um, i have personally have done 120 to 150 miles round trip daily and vantages we have lodges using them now so if you're on the fence you owe it to yourself to check us out we're also priced in the middle of the market and what that means is there's guys that cost more, guys that cost less, but where we are and what we offer is more than these guys, and we're just a little bit more than these guys, but if you take what they do and include what we call standard, they're actually more. So at the end of the day, East Cape's where it's at. Thank you guys going on 11 years of business. All the guys at the shop, they all say hi to you guys out there. Robert, this is awesome, buddy. You guys enjoy, enjoy. Take care, see ya.